Our new class term. As I moved towards my desk, I exchanged greetings with many familiar faces. Does really make for a fresh feeling. Well, we aren't freshmen, so that much is to be expected. And next to me sits. Hi there, nice to be with you. <laughs> like that, my usual seatmate is sitting next to me. Now that you mention it, pretty often. You have been counting? The seating arrangement is based on the attendance list that is arranged in alphabetical order. Because of that, it easily happens that we, Asaba and Chinoase, become seatmates. Don't just stand there with your mouth open. Well, I know what she's getting at. えっと、初めましての人たちが多いのかな。今日から皆さんの担任を務めることになった。先生、どうして上司姿なんですか？あ、これは私は体育の先生なので、この格好の方がわかりやすいかと思う。Yeah, man, why does it matter? Get out of her face. Oh man, for that cheap reason, seriously? でも。so she's basically saying that she'll uh, she'll attend today's opening ceremony in that jersey. She throws a short glance at me. I think you're in the middle of introducing yourself. そう、そう。自己紹介がまだでした。これから1年間この教室で皆さんと一緒に。先生、マジかわいいっす。Some dude would say <笑>そ、そんな可愛くなんてないです。私なんてもういい年のおばさんで。朝場先生、ホームルームを進めてください。you broke the chalk. <laughs> I'll help you pick them up since they calm down. I couldn't bear it any longer and speak speak to her while picking up the chalk that's scattered on the ground. Sensei, don't call me like that at school. It's my mom! Oh my Jesus. My mother's our teacher. It's not good. Oh Jesus. Yeah, that's the spirit. Keep at it. She still looks like a college student. In fact, it shouldn't be more than a miracle of years that, that had passed since she graduated. By the way, the fact that she called herself my mother in a small voice isn't, isn't just a playful joke. This person really is my mother. Oh, Jesus. Aoi? <laughs> My biological mother died right after giving birth to my little sister. My mother and my father also died due to an illness a few years ago. And my, in a sense, cursed family has been saved by Aoi-san. She was my father's second wife and she raised the two of us by herself when she passed away. I'm grateful to her. I really am, but... It's going to be so weird because now they're going to be talking about our mom. Get out of here. Probably because she's so close to her age, students often don't see her as a teacher. 
先生は未亡人で、実は二人の子供がいて。Please don't tell her you're my mother. みんな静かに、騒ぐと他のクラスに迷惑が。<笑> And of course, she's also too young to be a mother. Looking at her, you just can't leave her alone. She's plain hopeless by herself. You <laughs> could, 楽しいクラスになりそうだね。Not so much for me, to be honest. But Mil, So, and Aoi san, huh. At the very least, I won't get bored in this year's class. <laughs> With the opening ceremony finished, school's over for today. I've already decided what to do after school, or rather, it has been set in stone. Now then. Excuse me. I need to h o l o the s e n s e i But you look like a nurse. If you talk about the sign on the door, I just flipped it over. Oh, Nanda Yuma ka. So, yeah. Oh my god, please don't let this be my sister or something. Yeah, it is. Aoi to a Hanasta no ka? Well, yeah, she's my homeroom teacher. Naruhodo. So let the coco sujits, Kigenga yoka to a keka, Aitsa. This coat wearing woman's name is Sauda Nao. A person you're kind of reluctant to call Sensei. She's a school nurse here and she graduated to, together with Aoi san. I've known her for quite a long time now. And that's why. What's the matter? I thought it was my father. And that's why. 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 Well, sorry for not being as sociable as dad. Talking like this to each other is also completely normal. My father was a teacher, and both she and Aoi had been his students. Also, she was a little. She was in a literature club that my dad supervised. Apparently, she had been only the only member. Partially due to the reason she's been visiting her, our house pretty often and care for my sister, and I like her. And I like an older sister. She's pretty harsh with words, but she's also someone you can rely on. If you don't want me to work, can I go home? とりあえず死なない程度に働いてくれ。れ、悪意。It's gonna kill me. Since my first year, I've been helping her out during lunch breaks and after school as health committee member. But halfway through the year, it became something more like a habit. So I'm quite used to this sort of exchange. I'll be feeling somewhat annoyed in the face of her never changing ma- ma- manner. I slip my arms into the coat. Your work attitude is impressive as ever, I must say. しかたないだろう。お前がやった方が女子からの受けがいいんだ。I can tell. I don't think that's a good enough reason to make a student to do this. As I throw complaints at her, I long sense her utterly pointless. The door opens. 失礼しまーす。おれ、お前の仕事だ。<laughs> Already. It's your work, strictly speaking. Clearly voice to make complaint to her in a low voice. I point the approaching girl to an empty chair. Now then, let's to- let today's work begin. God, we're a doctor. でも今回は私が悪いんです。彼氏からお前と付き合うのは重いって言われちゃって。Oh man, what kind of doctor am I? Am I the love doctor? I understand. This is the kind of work I do. Wearing a c o a treating simple injuries and listening to love troubles. I'm basically played the school doctor. やっぱり男の人は軽く遊べる感じの子がいいんですよね。I don't know whether it's spread by gossip or what, but there are lots of girls coming here for love counseling. As a girl spreads her sorrows, I look her in the eyes and begin to speak. I don't think there's a need to change yourself. Warping your character because of guy only will only come back to bite you in the future. Instead, you should try to find someone who loves you the way you are. I think that's a better approach. Falling in love isn't something one should do. I, who said that to Mio, am given this advice. But if you still can't give up on him, I'm not as conceited as to think I, that I can truly save someone with this. However, 
How about you try to make him seriously fall for you with all you've got? If these hollow words can help someone in any way, then I couldn't ask for more. That's what I'm thinking. I'm glad I didn't make her cry. It's good that she's feeling better. I always mutter words like this in my mind. Words that should originally be stemming from the person who receives counseling. In other words, it's simply self-satisfying. This is today's medicine then. It's candy, though. I take out a random candy from one of the coat's pockets and hand it over to her. Take care. Looking at the girl who leaves the room with a smile, I feel somewhat proud of this act of self-satisfaction. I am a low doctor. <laughs> I can't help it. How exactly am I a womanizer now? Oh, jeez. How many came in? I swear it was only one. I doubt girls fall in love with this easily. So you know about that. Actually, I took off every poster that I spotted after that, but they're always replaced by new ones in no time. I guess it's not much use unless I capture the culprit and talk to them. Standoffish? For now, I'd rather she didn't bring all these hollow words I always bout. So what exactly am I supposed to do then? In my mind, I'm attentive enough as it is. I think that's basically the same, though. By the way, I came here to work. Why are you making me do love counseling? Hmm, I guess next time I'm gonna go to a doctor and just like, hey, I got broken up, you know, help me, <laughs> help me. <laughs> Pretty sure there's other, there's other work as well. Then how about falling in love and doing some sparkling yourself first? What's that suggestive smile for? Oh, Yuma, it's time to go. You're right. Looking at the clock, it's already quite late. I somewhat feel that she dodged the question, but I don't intend to pry into it. I nearly fold the borrowed coat together and place it on the table near me. If I handed it over her, chances would have been high for her to leave it somewhere in the crumpled state. I'll be leaving then. Ah, oh, Mokuro-san. Mata ashita na. Seen off by the nurse who is basically like a sister to me, I leave the infirmary behind me. <laughs> the moment I leave the school building, I can't I catch sight of two familiar faces. Mio and Tsukushima. Yeah, you two are still at school? Oh, the entrance ceremony preps? Good job, Mio. Oh. By force of habit, I wanted to pit Mio's head like I do with my sister, but I managed to restrain my hand in time. No, I just wanted to pat her head. I see that I didn't escape you. Yeah, I'd be grateful you did so from now on. I then moved the hand that had lost its place towards Mr. Kusima's head. <laughs> because I can't pet Mio, so I have to do it to you. If not, it'd be awkward, okay? Well, because I can't pet Mio. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> Being stroked from left and right. The always diligent and composed Kashima weeks becomes meek. 
The always scary when angry PMC chairman is just a spoiled girl like this. We're praising you, so why don't you just enjoy it rather than complain? I might make her cry again if you leave her to me, don't you think? Only if it's about Mio? Seems she can't trust me that much in other areas. <laughs> it looks like you're already angry. I'll bear that in mind. Mio, let's get going. Waving goodbye to Tsukushima, the two of us set off. That's great, Mio. Was the president also preparing the assembly hall for the entrance ceremony? Listen to Mio talking happily. I throw in appropriate words at times. Enjoying this typical piece of everyday life, we make our way home. Oh god, it's back. ガイト。入学式の準備、お疲れ様でした。うん。声田君も疲れ様。おまえか、who ちなみに写真写りは悪い方向。実物はもっといい男です。うん。あ。もしかして会長気になっちゃってる系ですか気になってるって言えばそうかな。だったら今度紹介しますよ。しかし珍しいっすね。会長が男に興味を持つなんて
Her eyes are still faintly wet. She can't even see well with her eyes like this. I swear, this girl. I see. Glad to hear that. Looking at her, she indeed seems to have recovered. You'll hardly find any Japanese who hates them, right? <laughs> the cherry blossom trees would surely be indignant if they were hated because of cedar pollen. Our usual slightly off of conversation. Being with her like this makes me forget all those painful memories. Right, memories like that that day several years ago. Without any particular intention to do so, I place my hand on my chest and confirm the throbbing of my heart. The beating rhythm sets my hand at ease. Oh, sets my mind at ease. No, it's nothing. Ugh, it's the girl from the beginning. With a cat on her head. If you're feeling better, then let's get going. She's a stalker. I'm home. Oh, it's too cute. It's too cute. How do you make it a... Uh, how do you... Is it this one? Is it this one? Let me see. Yeah. Oh, man. It's not... Really? Alright, never mind. <laughs> then since she sees me, she locks me into embrace. I've been wanting to tell you this several times already, so I'll say it now. I honestly doubt there are mothers hugging their sons when they're th this old, you know. Now you're just being defiant. Let's think of some other way to accomplish that. And that's how it always goes. Aoi-san has been this kind of person from the beginning, so I've partially given up anyways. Still, she should put up letting go of her son into consideration in the near future. The infirmary as usual. Figure that you kept quiet about becoming my homeroom teacher. Was that all right with you, calling yourself a widow and all that? Real son, huh? I can't express with such with just words how much salvation she currently does by always treating us this way. Don't say that. I know that I can always rely on you. These are my honest feelings. She's anything but unreliable. To begin with, my sister and I have been separated if it hadn't been for Aosan. By the way, Aosan, I'd like to change if it's alright with you. <laughs> I think she's a person who loves kids by nature. Actually, I should be calling her mom, but since she's always like this, it was hard to grasp a good opportunity to start doing so. And well, it's kind of hard to start doing it af now after all this time. Besides, because of our ages that far apart in the first place, it's also a bit embarrassing. So that's why I kind of end up using a different word to trick my mind and spare myself of said embarrassment. Is Konami in her in her room? Uh, I never. I don't understand shogi. It looks hard. Shogi again, and right after before the entrance exam, I swear that girl. Konami is my little sister, a young year younger than me. She'll also be attending Mihaya Academy starting this spring. Yeah, she has been influenced by dad. She's pretty good enough to make me play against her. Well, I'm going up then. Just as I'm about to open my mouth to ask, what now? She 
cute. She hugs me. It's too cute. Parent-child interaction, was it? <laughs> it somehow was the extraordinary effect of making you think twice if you're about to stray away from the right path or slight your parents. Parent-child interaction kind of scary power it has. <laughs> I still think it's too cute. She was like, too. <laughs> Phew. The first day of school after spring break wore me out more than I expected. From tomorrow on, Konami will also come along. With the lights in my room turned off, I look out of the window there. One can see a cherry blossom tree in full bloom. I like spring a lot. I suddenly remember Mew's question. I don't have any special feeling towards spring. If I was asked to choose between like and dislike, then I'd choose neither. And yet, I'm still looking forward to it every year. To me, that's the kind of season that spring is. Alright, I will be ending it right here, guys. This, this has been quite a pretty good episode, if you would call it. Um, yeah, I'm still liking it a lot. This, it's pretty cute, especially my mom over here you know, being like, Choo! or whatever. But yeah, guys, hope you guys liked it. Please leave a like, please subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you guys later, guys. Take care.